Hey, this is Kent from Pave Tool Innovators. We're here, we want to do a video on how to replace the replacement rubber in your ES pad. So we have four different sizes. This one that I'm working on is actually the 12 by 12, but we have pads that go all the way up to 18 by 36 inches. Um, but once you get to the point where your pad is, starts to rip, starts to be damaged, maybe even loses air and not creating suction, then we want to take a look at our pad and see if we got areas like this where that air would actually be going through and not being able to create that suction. So you'd be looking at your pad, making sure that it is in good condition. If not, then we can actually take the existing pad, we can pull it out, flip it over, and reinstall it to get a little bit more use. That's actually a good time to go right on Pave Tools website or call us and order your foam for when you need to replace it again. Other things too is for care, make sure that when you store the pad, store it upright. When it stores upright like that, you don't have to worry about that foam getting damaged. Um, because if you stick it in the back of a truck this way, if that slides around and gets caught on a bolt or some other uh, sharp material, it may rip the pad. Here while replacing the rubber, I got it set up on these 2x4s and a couple blocks of wood. Just a helpful way that you can keep the pad upright while you replace it. So now we're going to go ahead, we're going to pull this foam out, and I can show you too. I'll show you then too how you can uh, take it and just flip it over and then reuse it. All right, so now the foam is pulled out. Looks like this one's already been flipped over and used, um, but we would just take it and then you just push it right back in. So this is one rubber coming out. When you order your new one, your new one comes just like this. So brand new comes glued, ready to go right into your pad, should be cut to the proper length. But uh, just one way to help while you're installing is using a product like this. This is fluid film. This is just something that will help make this edge slippery as you do slide that pad in. There's no adhesive that's needed to put the pad in. It's just a matter of pushing it into that groove. But this is just one easy way to help you get it in. So we just spray it along those edges. And then when I take this rubber and I place it in, I usually try to start with the glued area right here on one of these edges. And I start there from that edge and I just start pushing it in. And I'll just start here on this front edge so you guys can see. But basically just taking this pad, sticking it up maybe on a 45 degree angle, and then taking your thumbs on the back side and just pushing that in. So you're gonna wanna push it in, hold pressure, as you're going around. And then you come to a corner, same thing, just pushing it in. One thing too, when you make a corner, try not to pull the foam too much. You might end up with some extra at the end. You wanna make sure that that foam is nice and vertical as it goes in. So now at this point, I do have the foam fully installed. And uh, one of the things too that you can do is take this pad, flip it over and put it on a concrete floor, hook your suction up to it, and you suctioning it down to the floor and releasing it several times will actually get that foam pushed totally in so you don't have to worry about anything pulling out or having any gaps anywhere. Um, other thing, just cleaning it up. And you're good to go just one thing that I do want to review too with you is if you do ever have a rip on your pad you can use a flexible adhesive um, they make some different uh, weather stripping glues out there and things like that so you can actually take a glue such as this and you can actually repair some of those rips that you may get in your pad while using or while moving around on the job site so hope this video is helpful if you guys have any further questions Feel free to call us here at Pave Tool and we're willing to help you out however we can.